Hello, Cancer. I'm gift. Sorry. Hello, Cancer. I'm the gift. 202. I'm Susie, and I'm going to read your cards for the week of the 15th of March. So, Universe, Spirit Guides, can we have the energies for Cancer for this week from the 15th of March? So, Cancer. Oh, Cancer, there's a... You've got one, two, three major arcana in the first five cards. Hence, on the 15th of March, The magician and the knight of cups so this magician he's got four roads to choose from he's he's feeling pretty good he's a wizard um and the knight of cups on top of that is someone coming in to offer you love so you're feeling quite willful quite strong and you're making a choice of which path to take usually uh for yourself and you can make things go up and down it's all down to you the decision the knight of cups this water sign comes in to offer this love there's romance abound there's romance about and there's a choice in love here so choices choices cancer what am i going to do who am i going to choose what path am i going to take is it love it looks like you want to take the road of love okay but the devil's here the devils are here, Capricorn or just uh, someone who's got um, a toxic energy, right? So they could be on drugs or drink or gambling or, you know, so this is toxic, passionate, sexual energy that resides over this choice you're trying to make, okay, in love. All these roads, but you're trying to decide which road to take for your future. There's a decision. This Knight of Cups comes in when you're making this decision, offers this romance or this love message, and you're like, oh, what? Who? Which one of these women is he going to choose for a start? Beauty, you know, it's just huge choices in everything, right? You're offered lots of options basically so this devil here is coming in and you're feeling almost maybe like you're controlled by these options it's like you're being manipulated by these choices it's like you don't want this many choices you want to be independent on your own looking after animals being in the garden um getting your book published uh this this is kind of this passion this sexual passion is kind of interfering in these four paths that you want to take for your future um and someone is coming in to reciprocate some charity towards you to give you a gift um this knight of cups i think it's this this fire passionate again this sexy passion is coming at you um you're in your element here You've got this Queen of Cups here in the love zone, honouring her heart with this golden cup and the chalice and and um, this apple, this golden apple, right? And you're trying to be discerning and cut to the, to the quick and cut to the, the, the person you want to be with and cut to the truth you've got this king of wands this fire he's a king so you've got these two knights here coming in with sort of messages of love and they're trying to give some action of love like you're trying to be independent single but someone comes in and wants to reciprocate and help you right you're sitting there feeling quite happy in love as you are right maybe because these two people are fighting for you the sword of truth comes in. The king of wands is up here sort of to save the day or a businessman and he's got the passion. Um, and it, the world is here, which is, is a complete 
end like it's an ending a completion of like but it's also about starting again and look at you've got these these it's travel it's starting again something you've done it before but now you've got the t-shirt so it could i feel that look choices four roads four things to choose from four tools here you've got all the tools at your disposal right you, you can make anything a massive success. You might be offered travel at the end of this week. People are offering you love and passion. You, you feel you're being manipulated by love, though. You just want to get your yourself independent and, and solvent so you can maybe reciprocate stuff to other people. But these knights are coming in and they want you. Queen of Cups here, you're just sitting there in your element speaking your truth cutting to the truth cutting people out that know that can't that aren't helping you there's this because this devil's in the way it's like a this temptation the king of wands is up here sits on his throne it says business is booming or you're going into business with this person or you're going to travel um there's there's a, a completeness you feel like a whole person you've got It's like you can make things float with your eyes. <laughs> no, that sounds really bizarre, right? But that's what I'm seeing here because these tools are on the floor here. At the end of this week, you're in the middle of this bubble, starting again. You can actually look at one of these tools and it works for you. Now, whether one of those tools is one of these men, I don't know. <laughs> but, yeah. You, you kind of you kind of own it and you're kind of um it's like i can hear i'm hearing you at the top of your game so loads of choices offers of of sex offers of love offers of you know but you're here and you're just saying i'm just going to be loving i'm just going to be open i'm going to be loving and i'm going to be truthful now who can fight with that nobody the king of wands is here and he's saying, well, I'm a king and I've got a, a wand and I'm I'm fire. But I also know my business. I also own myself. And if you're going to go traveling or if you want to take up any any road that you want, it's like been there, done that, got the T-shirt. But I'm going to, if I do this again, I'm going to be awesome at it. If I do this thing or I'm offered this thing again, I can do it with my eyes closed. That's how I'm feeling, Cancer. This is your reading. Angels and spirit guides, what would you like Cancer to know? Worth waiting for. Divine timing uh, is at work in your love life. Yes. So if you're getting these offers and you just want to be independent, single, that you're getting offers of charitable people to come in towards you, but they also want the love and they also want the passion from you. But you're just being here saying, well, I'm just a really real loving being and I'm kind of waiting for something a little bit more. She's a queen. They're knights. What were the angels? And and this nine of pentacles is travel as well, but it's achievement. of, of This is achievement, right? Where... And people say, oh, it's an independent card, you're going to be single. What it is, is when you get to this, say you've got a book and it's in the drawer and you take it out of the drawer and this is the the time you get it published and people go, oh, I helped you get there, right? No, they didn't. You did it on your own. Even though this charity, charity is coming, it is coming, you've already achieved something on your own. You already know you've got the tools. You already know what this passion is you already know this is manip that the love manipulates you and and you got here into this independence on your own regardless it's very tempting this love it's very tempting these offers but you're honoring you are honoring your heart you do want love you but you want truth at the same time and you're going to be offered something new and it's worth waiting for believe me you Cancer, what would you like, Cancer, to know for the 15th and the work, week of the 15th of March? Week of the 15th of March for Cancer. Let your friends help you. Ask and accept support from others. See, this support, they are coming in with support. You've already independent. You've already done the thing. You've already the magician. Angels and spirit guides. People want to offer you things. 
angels and spirit guides. What would you like cancer to know? Week of the 15th of March for cancer. Loads of cards here. What am I going to do? So we've got heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to a love life. Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy and stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. It says love yourself first on the bottom of the deck. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. This is this queen. This is your element. So whether this is a queen coming towards you or this is you being your queen in love, the, the people are always catalysts for, for what energies you need to embody, whether it's them or you. These are this, The energy of Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer is in this water card. Emotion, water, heart, fire, passion. Loves to run in and out, this guy. He's on a moving horse, you know. You've got to think, just be discerning. Do you really want this? Is is yeah? He might be offering you something, reciprocating something, but you're gonna honor your heart this time for the truth and wait for this King of Wands, because you can go round and do this properly this time. But you need you need a counterpart, a king, queen. Oh, I feel I'm I'm getting aggressive. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like? Cancer to know. It's, I feel that because it's like there's passion here. There's reconciliation. Heart, there is heart to heart conversations. It's like everything's coming in at once. But you've got, you are, it's a good week for you, Cancer. You've got choices. Change in direction. The changes you're experiencing are divinely guided. See, this direction is at, is at a crossroads. That's what it is. This is initially you're at a crossroads. Divine directed by willingness, it will, this is strength of will, willingness to open your heart to love and our guidance. You are, protect, you are protected now and in the future. So follow your path to the happy outcome you desire. Offers of love. It's tempting. You want to be single, but there's another offer of some reciprocation and some fun. But you're thinking, no, I'm going to honour my heart. I need to be loving and truthful. And then the King of Wands comes with change in direction. What would the angels and spirit guides like Cancer to know? What would the angels and spirit guides like Cancer to know? I'm, help, I'm with you, giving you the courage to make life changes that will help you work on your divine life purpose. Archangel Michael, that is. And you are a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth and all of its inhabitants. So this change in direction is heart-led, feeling-led. It's truth-led. It's God-led, Okay. This devil ain't cutting it for you. It's not. It's tempting, but it, these these knights are flying in and out. This you you're sitting on a throne, and you've got work to do. You've got spiritual work to do, Cancer, and that's that's that. And you're going to do it. Like, like you're you're you've mastered. You're a master. That's it. And it could be with this King of Wands, this fire sign. So, hope I've helped you, Cancer. Have a really good week. Um, I'm Susie, and if you'd like a reading with me, it's thegift202cs at gmail.com. Or just like and subscribe, that'd be nice. All right, bye-bye.